So having made our functions Euler and slope now let's try since we are to calculate the terminal velocity then let's try to calculate for its terminal velocity um, in our anal, anal para we found out when we um, try to um, When we try to plot at a let's say at a time let's say um a bigger time let's say 100 so it the velocity already reaches the terminal velocity so let's try to find the terminal velocity now now as you can see this one is 6 then step size is 0 0.1 and in every iteration we are printing the result so instead of doing that let's maybe let's just use 1000 then this one two. Okay. Then let's also transfer this one here so that we won't be um printing each iteration. Okay. Let's try so V at 1000 it's 53.3904 it's correct mm. let's um, okay this time let's store the values because we have displayed this but we haven't stored this so so as to plot these values for that, let's um, let's make still let's make an array. Uh, it's its rows will be equal to. divided by each plus one then let's have now this will be rows in two columns let's also have our index i other else let's okay so let's update let's have an let's store the updated values that is okay here wait um we can have it here. Okay. That is num or oops. Num go or then at I. Yes, at I. I and the first column that will be our time 
then at still at i but at column two this will be um our velocity then what other s um oh let's update i let's have i plus one let's see what the i plus one mm. What other else? Um, this one. You learn. Mm. Um, okay, let's have. Display. No, it does not have. It won't return any value. Uh, let's have this. Okay. I. Okay. Be before I proceed. I want to mention that our function need not to have um, an output just like this one. Um, in the um, before we edited this, um, before our third um, our third edition, we we had this um, function uh, during. Um, when we created our functions during that segment, our function Euler does not have any output. So, however, our function slope has an output SLP. So, a function can have an input, and uh, no, can have with in can is with input but no output, or can have both. Um, let's, let's try this, oops, yes, mm. it's already here, let's try. Wait, um, what we should print is the young car. Very big. Fifty three. Let's have this at uh, first mm, again. Zero. So at twelve. Then forty seven and seven, but there's no twelve. Why is that so? Hmm. Hmm.
So at t eight zero at t equal to eight. Let's see a. So here will be v at eight. This one, so this one will be v at ten. Eight two so ten. Be at ten, then ten seconds. Come back here. Ten. Ten plus each. Each is. Each. Is dt. Which is equal to two, so ten plus two. No, here. Hmm. Why? It's ten plus two. Hmm. Oh, Lord Jesus. What's the problem with this? So this will be tough. No, no, Liti. Time. It's at ten. So, so greater than no, than Liti. Um, here. So slope V So V at ten this one will be the increment so that would be this would be V at twelve it's ten plus two so this would be twelve um If it's twelve, then it should have been. Ah, um, uh, okay. Let's have this one. Df minus n, so this is already zero, but we haven't. Mm. Therefore, we should put this one here. Sorry for that noise. <sighs>